this is all made for all the odds to be against you to be as comfortable as possible for you to not go out of your comfort zone to stay happy and serve the corporate world and buy into the corporate world can you explain that again all right i'm going to go i'm going to go i'm going to go a step even before that okay we when we're kids when we're infants we're super curious right we're super super curious yeah okay and then we go into the schooling system all right and then the schooling system takes curiosity turns it into obedience right right exactly and then it takes you to obedience it tells you what to do exactly from 8 to 5 as a school and it tells you how to be happy and it gives you grades and it gives you gratification when you get good grades and to give you candy and to give you prizes when you do good and blah 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 and then you grow up it's the same thing if you're a good boy and you go to work you know you're gonna get this car you're gonna have this nice house like a good boy you know you're gonna have a big screen tv like a good boy you know and and they make sure that you stay in your comfort in your comfort zone and you eat comfort food you know to make you as comfortable as possible and everything is so available and cheap and affordable and possible for you to get to always be in your comfort zone and most people live in this comfort zone and could never get out okay like here my my schedule is a bit messed up when i come to egypt but i wake up at 6 a.m okay. yeah i wake up at 6 a.m not because i enjoy waking up i actually hate waking up at 6 a.m i hate waking up and it's dark i hate it you know but i wake up because i wake up i want to be outside my comfort zone okay i'll wake up i'll take a really cold shower in the morning you know i take a re i hate it you know but i make that because i make sure that i'm outside of my comfort zone you know if i'm on a diet or whatever actually i'm super excited for ramadan really super excited and 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 actually talking about ramadan it's the king of kings of being outside of your comfort zone and still crush. I could not have said that better. Okay. Bro, bro, they used to fucking fight wars, mindset. bro. Yeah. Mindset. Mindset. So I actually love Ramadan, bro. I love Ramadan and I'm excited for Ramadan. And I am excited to even crush harder. Because it's gonna put me even because my mindset is a lot more powerful than last Ramadan. So this Ramadan, I, 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 I'm excited to even crush more because I'm all about being outside of my comfort zone at all times. You know what I mean? Um, you know, so teaching yourself to always be outside of your comfort zone in small things like this, when real shit in your life happens, when you get fired, when you lose your job, when your business fails, when, 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 this is, this is, just, this is just normal life, bro. You just get up. You know, and you go and you keep going and you try again until, you know, you fail again, until you figure out the way it's going to work or what you like to do and you're going to do it. So staying outside of your comfort zone is one of the keys of success. And all the odds are against you to stay in your comfort zone, actually. You know what I mean, bro? So, so training, being fit, you know, running a fucking, you know, five miles a day, running or whatever. And just always being outside of your comfort zone is all part of success.